So one of our all-time favorite e-bikes that are fully charged is the recent Muller Tinker. Now, Tinker is a great word. And it means kind of like youthful, busy man about town. I'm here today with Felix, the Head of Development for Risa Muller. Hello Felix, how are you doing? Hello, I'm fine, thank you very much. Good, good, good. Um, we made our first videos back in Eurobike and we're very keen to, uh, to really talk through the new Tinker 2. It is our most popular model of Risa Muller in London um, and, and, and across the UK actually. It gives you a kind of injection of youth because it's so fun and nimble and nippy. All, all the team at Fully Charged love to ride this bike. It's just so fun and so compact and so easy. Yeah, so I think uh, you're absolutely right. Um, so I'm not quite sure if you're right with the, with the naming of the Tinker and the meaning, <laughs> but um, yeah, for sure it's um, a very dynamic and agile um, bike. Um, it's very compact and that's our intention to have a compact bike that you can use in the urban area, you can um, store it in the cellar, you can, with the adjustable stem, you have several options um, to handle it. You can yeah. flip the stem down, you can um, just twist it. Yeah. It's um, very so easy to do, isn't it, as well? Narrow, so. Yeah, you can you open the quick release. Yeah, and over then just here. pop this down like that. Yeah, that's, that's the one option. And then you can turn, yeah. turn this as well. You can put it down and then. So yeah. it, and I mean, like to get them into two, um, two of them into a, a, a RV or a or an estate car is yeah. very very easy yeah. without kind of scratching or or you know like kind of stressing. So it's it's really well designed in that. But then deeper than that, it actually um, it is so well designed that it actually can fit the entire household. Yeah. So that's a really clever part of it, and um, I. I mean, it's what five foot to six foot six. Yeah, so you can you can adjust the height of the handlebar. You can adjust the angle, so the virtual um, head tube length can be adjusted. Um, so it will fit the whole family. We see uh, a lot of um, yeah pa parents getting their kids to ride them, and really uh, across all different aspects of life. It, it really is a household bike. So the differences in between the Tinker 2 and the Tinker are actually quite minimal. Um, I mean, the frame is the same. Um, it's just the components that are different. So I guess the big difference is the, the, the smart system. So do you, do you want to talk a little bit about the differences yeah. there? Yeah, so um, with a new smart system, there's for sure a different system architecture. Um, but the obvious things are uh, the remote, the LED remote, uh, a different display um, that we can offer with the Tinker 2. Um, sure, the battery uh, with 545 watt hours yeah. and uh, the drive unit is still the uh, performance line. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and the only gearing option is uh, the Vario, means the Enviolo um, gear hub system, with this, which is a uh, continuous uh, shifting. So. It's one of the only compact cargo bikes that I know um, that has got the new smart system. And the new smart system allows you more connectivity, over the air updates, much more uh, features in terms of uh, locks and trackers that are uh, digital locks. And you can lock the bike with your phone, you can get alerts when it moves, and you can add all sorts of new apps. Now, that's just what it is today. In the future, it's future-proof because you'll be able to pair your Apple Watch with it. You'll be able to check your BPM. You'll be able to put your mode on anti-sweat. And there's, it's limitless what you can do now the bike is wired like this. What else is there about this bike which is, uh, which is, which is different? Oh, big one is the, connect. Uh, my pronunciation might not be right, but Schultz? Yes, that's Schultz, correct. Yeah. So Schultz, they make the best suspension seat post on the market and um, it's a real comfort um, joy that it just yeah. keeps you the same distance away from the pedals so um, if you did have knee injuries or anything like that in the past they won't be triggered by going over a very bumpy track because you're 
leg kind of stays the same distance away from the pedals because you're moving in a parallelogram yeah, format. So this, this radius or this radius will stay the same. So the distance between uh, your, or the, the BB and yeah. um, the yeah. saddle is always the same. Yeah. So it will be always the same rotation of your knee. Yeah, one feature which is standard now on the bike, it used to be an option. And this is one of my favorite things about the Risa Miller bikes. It's a constant variable transmission that allows you to seamlessly change the gear ratio and change through the gears without actually feeling it. Yeah, so if you want to have a, let's say, maintenance-free system, that's the absolute right choice. Although in, in combination with the um, gates, um, belt drive um, because then you don't need to care about um, putting oil on a yeah. chain yeah. and so on and, yeah. and also the wear is much less yeah. um, so especially in the urban area for commuting every yeah. day um, it's the perfect system. It comes in black as you can see here matte black or it comes in crystal white like this and so yeah one last feature is the cargo platform which is a great feature yeah, so it's a, just a simple snap-on feature and you can use the bike that compact, but if it's needed, you can just put on the cargo carry system and then you can put all the stuff from the grocery into, into that um, accessory. And as soon as you are back home, you can detach it and yeah. store it in your cellar or wherever you want. That's very clever. And uh, ultimately it's like having a car boot that you can just put on and put off whenever you want. Yeah. So yeah, another great piece of tech and engineering. So in closing, um, we'd like to say that the Tinker is really an all rounder, all year rounder, and really can be used for everything. It just feels as good as it always has. There's no real difference in the way the bike feels. It just, it's just such a really playful, fun bike to ride.